Tonight, one Gwinnett County resident is hoping to stall next Tuesday's vote on the proposed city of Mulberry. If passed, a referendum would create the new city in the northeastern part of Gwinnett County. But tomorrow, a judge is holding an emergency hearing. 11 Alive's Grace King explains what's at stake here. I don't want the people that vote thinking that they're going to get one thing. Uh, that is a city that, you know, cannot tax, cannot levy a property tax. And in reality, they're getting something else. Steve Hughes wants his part of Gwinnett County to remain unincorporated Gwinnett County. I didn't ask to be included, you know, in the city. He believes the proposed charter for the city of Mulberry raises several constitutional questions. Well, that's uh, the reason why I have brought the lawsuit and basically why I'm opposed to the city. On Thursday, a Gwinnett County judge will hold an emergency hearing to consider Hughes' lawsuit. He hopes the judge will postpone next Tuesday's vote. The best case scenario uh, for me would be that the judge would rule the uh, charter unconstitutional and would stay the election uh, until uh, a new charter can be presented. But proponents of Mulberry, like Lindsey Paul, worry they can't wait much longer. I hope everybody gets out and votes on May 21st and we get this pushed through and we are able to save our community and make sure that we determine what the character is for our area. She hopes the judge will dismiss Hughes' lawsuit and let the voters decide now rather than later. It's a complete waste of the time and actually I almost take offense, actually do take offense to them trying to suppress the voters when what we have actually utilized and, it, and petitioned our government for relief. That emergency hearing is scheduled for 2.30 on Thursday. In what could become the city of Mulberry, Grace King, 11 Alive News.